Hey, what's going on guys? x this here, and welcome back to another Horizon Zero Dawn, the Complete Edition episode. We're jumping right into it again. If you didn't see the last episode, then I'll leave a link in the description down below for you to obviously go check out. Um, but basically, to sum up that episode, uh, we actually made it to Meridian, which is really, really cool. Not what I expected, um, if I'm completely honest. So it was really cool to obviously see that. We saw some new machines and everything. Um, you know, ones that can fly, some big, like, rhino-type creatures or whatever. Um, like a big kind of, like, world bus in a sense, right? I've seen some really cool machines now, so it's really good. We did a load of quests. It was a long episode. We found out more about um, Odin and stuff and what he's been up to. So, just overall, man, we've been on that grind and it's been so fun. Like, the, um, you know, like, the scenery and everything, like, as as we are like here for example right like look at this it just looks so cool like and i my graphics are on like low or like medium or whatever right there basically turned all the way down and this game still looks beautiful really so it's really really nice what we're gonna do though is grab these new quests and then we'll probably do either the main quest or some like side quest or something like that um i can indeed you're the one the vanguard has been crowing about the Nora who tracks criminals and traitors with her second sight. Uh -huh. If only you'd use it to help me. A thief raided my home and took my brother's sword. Okay. Uh, thief. Tell me about the robbery. Don't leave anything out. Let's do it. It was brazen and professional. They took only the sword, my most valuable possession. Oh, the no. thief went out through the window and scared the shadow off my steward. Otherwise, it would have been... I thought he was going to say something else then. I thought he was going to swear. Um, sword. Why would someone steal the sword? It's priceless, made from the burnished antler of a lancehorn, finely inlaid with studded stones oh, nice. all down the... Uh, okay, I get it. <laughs> I get it. You like the That's sword. That's not even why it's important. The twelfth Sun King gave it to my brother for his military service. He was killed in battle during the liberation. I was saving it for my nephew who stranded at Sunfall with the Karja in shadow. Damn. Uh, nephew? How did your nephew wind up in Sunfall? Most of the old clergy backed the Mad Sun King, so when he fell, they ran out of fear of retribution. As an honor guard to a venerable priest, my nephew had no choice but to go with them. Now that my brother is gone, my nephew is my heir, so that sword really belongs to him. Uh. And after all he's been through, I won't be able to look him in the face if I don't get it back. No problem. Uh, okay. I'll see what I can do about the robbery. Have Let's a word it. with my steward if you need to. He saw the thief escape, and listen. All I want is the sword back. Meridian, and my family for that matter, has seen enough strife already. If I can get it back, all is forgiven. No retribution necessary. All right, sounds good. Um, I also forgot to mention at the start of this episode, um, if you wouldn't mind, please subscribe to the channel if you obviously haven't already. We're trying to hit 5k subs by the end of the year, so that helped me out a ton if you could go do so. Let's grow this channel, man. Let's see how far we can get it and everything like that. All right, let's get another free sample box because, you know, I've been wanting those free sample boxes recently. Let's right. go. Oh. What did you want to discuss? Oh, oops. You're an outlander. My bad. Which is good. But a Nora, which might be bad. Do you fear the ruins of the old ones like many nope. in your tribe? We've no. been down there, dude. Although some can be dangerous. Then you may have come across what I seek. Okay. In your travels, have you found strange vessels? emblazoned with symbols of the old ones maybe they consist of a hollow cylinder with a crescent handle affixed at both ends if no idea bring me these vessels in sets of four i will gladly trade what i have for them okay um more about you so you're interested in the old ones more than interested i study every ancient you don't look interested my hands on but years of study have made me too comfortable at my desk I can't even bear the sun, if the truth be known. I don't know how I'll manage to take a partner. My family presses me for an heir. Damn. Uh, don't look at me. <laughs> yeah, no, no. Oh, no, 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 I'm, I'm not looking. In fact, my father already has someone he wants me to wed. She doesn't interest me. Damn. I wish I had a brother to carry this burden. I would rather be left to my precious little vessels. Damn, man. Yeah, you, have, you, you have some women sort of issues or something. Some weird for? issues, man. I'm convinced they were used in conjunction with each other in sets. 
Some people believe they were used for tea ceremonies. Well, so good, man. Others think they held sacred essences and oils for worship. But I believe they were used for the solemn custom of shaving one's beard. Okay. One for water, one for lotion, and so on. Each fluid in its special vessel, majestically <laughs> applied to the face at each stage of the rite. It must have been breathtaking. Oh but my which God, vessel dude. was used for which? I have to know. I have to continue my research. Are you sure people didn't just drink out of them? Drink? Out of such finely crafted earthenware? <laughs> Don't be ridiculous. God, God, you have some. Weird issues, yes, my yes. friend. Trade quickly. I have work to do. Oh my god. So we have reward boxes then. Um Okay. So basically we just gotta go search for stuff. Oh I already have these. Um cool. Uh see you later, alligator. I will leave you to the hunt. Be sure to delve into the ruins. Perhaps your travels have taken you through ancient ruins? Let us speak of it. Uh, we literally just spoke. Uh, do you have a five second memory? Uh, you goldfish now? Huh? You goldfish? <laughs> um, let's go down here. Uh, is this guy we have to talk to? I oh, know, we talked to him earlier actually because we got our free sample box. I think it's above maybe unless we can get through this area. Oh, hold up. Hold up. Wait a minute, Mr. Postman. <laughs> okay. Um, aha. Abled adventurers. Oi there, Outlander. Name's Vilgund. Did you come to the city looking for work? I mean, I came to the uh, city because I've done a video. Enough but... to buy garb more becoming of your... Okay, stop there if you want me to hear you out. <laughs> uh, I only meant uh, a well-molded woman sure. such as you. Little does he know I'm actually a man. I heard an interesting rumor about a Banuk camp. Tame machines, the rumor said. So I... Uh, I hired men to investigate. To just investigate, that's all. Those Banuk are canny. Too canny. I paid up front. Well, Do I have no idea what you're talking about right now. I've had no word back. So now you're hiring someone to find the last men you hired. <laughs> <laughs> They're a sunk cost. This rumor's worth more to me. Um, tell me more about this rumor. So is there any more to the rumor about this camp? <laughs> The last bunch just wanted to know about the reward. <laughs> You're a smart one. Thanks. This camp isn't even big enough for a name up where the snow won't thaw. They say the Banuk there live alongside machines. Peaceful as you like. Keep them, use them, sing to them. If it's true, if we learn how they huh. do it, think how valuable that would be to all the tribes. Yeah, probably wouldn't end well, though. valuable. You mean they'd pay you for it. Ha. <laughs> Girl, I'm not made of straw. You're also not made of much beard. Um, that didn't make sense. What can you tell me? English words, but so good. <laughs> the Banuk women. Doesn't have a very snow witch. Well crafted all. beard. Cold eyes, cold <clears throat> <laughs> They choose <laughs> to live up there in Ban Ur, in the ice. Trying to have a conversation. It's like chipping them out of the stuff. They prefer machines for company. That's why I'm putting my shards on this rumor. Then they might not want outsiders to know about this place. <laughs> Their mystic act. No care for possessions, for luxuries. Pile of slag. Those people bargain harder than the winter frost. Dude, okay. Uh, you're Are you some kind of merchant? You don't seem to have any wares. Oh, brains. More I mean, what? An explorer. But you send other people to do your exploring. <clears throat> exactly. All right. More of an opportunist. Uh, girl. Uh, Nora. Woman. <clears throat> Huntress. We live in a world of opportunities. Risky opportunities. But why should risk stand in the way of a lucrative prospect for the likes of me? All right. I'm more of a gambler. Yeah, there you go. If I did look into your rumor... You won't need to climb up the shoulders of the world for it. It's on the edge of Banuk land, beneath the anvil of the moon. Okay. And you look like you know your way around the savage east. Uh, um, the east. If it's true they walk among machines without fear in this camp, well, 
You can't miss that, can you? Payment on return. Dude, you're such a weird one. You should literally go and talk to the other quest giver I just talked to. Like, you both have women problems or something. He doesn't know how to talk to women. The other one doesn't know how to get women. Like, no offense. But, like, dude, they're, they're a couple of weirdos. I'm, I'm just saying that. Like, Meridian. More like, uh, goddamn. Yep. Alright. <laughs> oh, got a book. The Sun Faith. Um, if you want to read it, then just pause the video. There we go. Hopefully that was okay for the people wanting to read it. Um, let's go talk to this guy. Ronora. I'm the mournful Naman. Naman? My apologies that we meet like this. Like this? In grief. You hold yours close. Like a talisman. Wait, forgive me. You didn't come for reparations? Someone you lost to the sun ring? Oh, no. I uh, know about the Red Raids, but the Karja owe me nothing. I see. Well, I could use the help of a strong-willed outlander. Then I would owe you very much indeed. Yo, that's me. These people seek to honor their loved, their lost, with their own voices. Not mouthing Karja rituals to Karja stone. But there are obstacles. And while Meridian holds its breath for any disturbance... These robes only tie my hands. Okay, uh, obstacles? Uh, what kind of obstacles? The first pilgrim is an Asaram who seeks to visit the shrine of kings on the road to the city. He waits there now, forbidden to enter by an old sun priest who suffer no heathen. This Utaro lost her companion on the edge of the jewel at a pool where snap moths gather. Fun. A shrine was built there to ward off the machines. And its effectiveness leaves much to be desired. And the Manuk would paint a mark on the sun's climb. A call to the machine spirits, I understand. They need no beckoning. Glindhawks perch there. Drawn to the spires shining. So clear the machines out of two shrines and move a priest out of the other. All I can ask for is your charity and that their stories are heard. Okay. Rituals? Naman, rituals and prayers can't bring back those who are lost. No. But it can help those who grieve to find themselves. It can lend them strength and hope, like a new sunrise. And then, why ask an outlander I for help? I didn't think your priesthood would ask outsiders for help. If only the sun would set on our pride. Until this is done, I am no sun priest. To wear a red robe was an aspiration. I aspired. Now our hoods make us blind. We whisper reconciliation, but forget how the old king's priests sang the words and blessed the killing. The killing? Damn, dude. You mean the Red Raids? Yes. And the sacrifices that came after. Why did the priests go along with all that bloodshed? Sometimes we Karja are more concerned with what is tradition than what is right. Fair enough. Maybe the Karja and Nora aren't so different. Yeah, new Sun Priestess? You're oh, priests, disappointed I mean. with the Sun Priests, but you still wanted to be one? I spent my whole life looking up to the temple. My brother's voice echoing in his arches. Even he couldn't turn me away, and how he tried. In the end. He said, when we were loved, our robes were dyed in cinnabar. Now they are stained in blood. Damn, dude. How so? Our robes are handed down to us. Most of the old priests fled rather than be seen in the glare of a new sun. And so we are left to wear their sins. For me, at least, they hang heavy. Um, your brother probably died, Where unfortunately. Now? He waits for me on the trail oh, nice. of the sun, I hope. Cool. Wait. I don't he know. spoke out against the sacrifices. For a priest probably to not. question the Sun King's will, his punishment was worst of all. You lost someone you loved, too. Oh. I'm sorry. No. Not lost. When I took on these robes... Okay. He, he's dead, but... found his memory. He's connected. Oh, I'm sorry, dude. I can to help those in mourning. To honor their memories is to honor us all. Well, that's kind of depressing, dude. We're like 15 minutes in, and then this guy just straight up, you know, 
brings those vibes. Don't look all innocent right now, nah, man. Like, nah, man. You goddamn bringing all that. You, don't, don't talk to me, dude. Damn, we should go to him and be like, yeah, we have lost someone. Um, the hundred Aloys that died before this episode and everything, you know, getting owned by different machines. Um, do we have another quest we can get? No, we don't. What's this? Investigate the crime scene. Oh, is that the side quest? Um, so we've got bandit camps we've done. Open activities for the hunting grounds. We've got loads of tutorials we need to do. Open errands. Hunting for the lodge. Uh, that's just... Hunting grounds, as I can't talk. We got loads and loads of these right now. Cool. Grab this. I hope everyone's having a fantastic day, though. Let's just get this started, dude. Grab those three quests there. And now it's time to get on with those quests. Really enjoying this game so far, though. Um, move. Hey. Don't look at me like I'm a weird one. Wait, so crime scene. Is crime scene in here? Nah, crime scene's got to be up, right? Uh, can we jump up? Okay. Dude, I'm just walking around boxes, man. Alright, so crime scene's got to be down this way, then. Wait, I'm so confused. Unless it's down. No way it's down. The crime scene. Where's that? Uh, oh, it's just talking to this person. You saw the thief make a run for it. My back was to the wall. You see, wasn't expecting someone to crawl out the window. He ran past me, dressed in grey, clutching the sword. That's all I saw. By the sun, my heart nearly seized up. Okay. We're not gonna ask him more questions, dude. Damn. Okay, and then uh, investigate the crime scene. Oh, is this literally the crime scene? Drops of blood leading away. Ah, uh, wait. I'm confused. What's a sword there? So you're telling me it was just there for everybody to take? I th I'm pretty sure, right? Oh, whatever. Now that makes sense. There's blood there and everything. Lovely. Um, and you're telling me all of these people weren't here to witness it. Like, damn, I'm guessing it was done during the night, but... Come on, man. I'm still on the trail. Oh, yeah, we're still on the trail. I can see it. Oh, hold up. Uh, is that the guy I spoke to last time? For a free sample box, probably, right? Oh, that's the gambler guy. Never mind, he didn't even have a free sample box. Still more blood. I can do anything. You've got cut for... Trailings here. Take someone a look at these wares. Hello. Did someone run past here holding a sword? Sure did. He grabbed some linen off the stand here and took off down the stairs behind you. He was bleeding, so maybe he needed a binding. Blast it! That was expensive cloth. I can't believe I paid for that thief's bandage. Well, I mean, did you really know that he was going to take your stuff? Um, let's go down here. Uh, okay. The old freehold lands are at the mercy of the She's just chilling. If the thief came this way, there's only one way he could have gone. Forward. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. Alright. Um, no sign of the thief. Someone must have seen him go by. Yeah, that's very true. Do we just talk to this lady here, maybe? That's what I was thinking of doing. How am I supposed to get a good night? This one, probably. Did you see anyone yeah. run through here? He would have been holding a sword. Yeah. Almost crashed into me, too. He ran down the parapet here and went down the lift. No way you'll catch him now. Are you sure about I that? I didn't see a sword, though. He wasn't carrying anything. Not a damn thing. Just ran like his ass was on fire. Haha, <laughs> I like this lady. The thief must have ditched the sword. But where? Hmm. Maybe he had help. I think I know where I would ditch that a sword. Stall would have been a convenient drop -off. In there. Or the stall, yeah. But... I don't know, man. I don't know. Oh, there's more quests down there, though. Um. Okay, so what is this? No. We we want to do the main quest, right? But since we're already on this, we should probably be doing that quest. So, return to the merchant. Um. Should we grab the quest now? Nah, let, let's, let's go do this first. 
We're already on this um, little errand. Hi, dude. He waved at us. All right, let's go then. Maybe that lady's covering up for him, huh? I'm back. What is this expensive cloth that you're talking about? Wait, can I just talk to her? It looks like the thief got away, but without the sword. I thought maybe he dropped it off somewhere. Like here, for instance? What? No. Your voice went higher. I had nothing to do with this. You sure about that? I guess we'll see when I get the city guard to toss your stall and question your customers. Uh, hold on. There's more to this. Oh. You've got there? a reputation for shining light in the darkness, so I know you'll listen. You're right. The sword was passed to me, and I passed it on to someone else. Who? It's going to be sold, but not for profit. The shards will go to people in need. You expect me to believe that? I can prove it. Meet my friends at the water mill in the lower village. They'll explain everything. If oh, they don't convince wait. you, come right back with the guards. I'm not going anywhere. It wouldn't matter if you did. I'd find you. <sighs> but all right. I'll check out the water mill. Okay. Dude, if you want in shards, just ask me for shards. I mean, not right now, because I have, like, none. But ask me in, like, you know... 10 minutes time. I'm sure I have loads of shards for you. Like, damn. Just gonna sell someone else's sword like that? I mean, if the sword was used to, you know, kill loads of innocent people or something, or just in general was a bad sword, hey, go ahead. But it's not theirs to obviously sell, so. Wait. Uh, oh. There's a thing we gotta press. A lever or a lever, however you wanna say it. I didn't just jump in down there, dude. We need like a glider. Come on. While we wait, um, look at me, dude. I look pretty cool, right? Oh, what? yeah. Sticking to my armor. It, Aloy, I was literally just saying how cool you look, and now you're just saying that the armor is too hot. Like, come on, man. Um, There it is. Finally. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Hallelujah. Right, need for speed time. Go, go, go. This looks cool, dude. A working elevator. Who would have thought? I'm surprised they know what an elevator is, you know? Or a lift, as I would call it. And I, I suppose you could call that elevator as well. Alright, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. If only we had a glider, though, just jump straight off. I, I didn't say in the... Um, in the last episode, I was trying to, and I completely forgot. Imagine an MMO like a, a, like this, like Horizon. That'd be so cool, like gather, getting, um, gathering uh, stuff in the open world and going and killing like machines together and like big bosses and everything like that. It'd be so good. Obviously, PvP would be kind of hard um, because this like so fluid, like the gameplay and stuff. So. It'd be, like, easy to kill people, kind of, but it'd be, like, a cool concept, I think. Like, kind of like a Horizon Zero Dawn MMO, but not strictly Horizon Zero Dawn. I just mean, like, a general, like, going around, riding machines, killing um, world bosses, world PvP and stuff. Like, it'd be cool. This is my opinion, though. I know what she's not interested in. As I was saying, no better offer for snap ball lenses. I'd give my oath on it. By the sun, don't start spitting in your palm. Huntress, I apologize on behalf of my partner. Silent partner. <laughs> Silent partner. If the sun would only grant my prayers. Never mind snap more lenses, Huntress. There's no market for those. A long leg lens, though, you'd be well rewarded for. Yeah, I noticed. Um, so which part so is it you want? Um, no market for a snap maw lens. It's good, strong stuff. You can hammer it into anything. Where do you think we are? Some trading post with sawdust on the floor? This is Meridian. We have culture. I know culture. Just <laughs> the other day, I was watching the hunting trials. Oh, great sun, lend me the strength of midday. The sun's baked your head if you think we'll shift long leg lenses at a time like this. 
Okay. I'm standing here, uh, guys. Hello. I've told you as many times as the spire is tall, craft and artisanship is who away, we Aloy. are. Craft doesn't win a war or keep the machines from your farms. What you need is good, old-fashioned, plain... Oh, yes. Old-fashioned, plain, hammered work. If ever something glittered, you'd throw it back. If Karja had built that elevator, they would have stopped at a good-looking shaft. <laughs> All those years of delving, and you never found a sense of humor. Hey, he's pretty funny. Enough! Well? They're a blunt people, the Nora. Why do you two even work together if you can't agree on anything? <sighs> it's a symbolic gesture. No tithes to the oh sun. Oh my court. god, the like sun to now. in the beginning, Renine. Just... Just tell me which part you want. A long leg lens. A snap my lens. Just get them both. Fine. Just, yeah, whatever. I can see that you're busy. Wait, wait. You drove her off. Snap my lens. What do you say? I drove her off. <laughs> That's rich. <laughs> Listen, Huntress. Get, get a nun. Lens. Give them a nun. Hunters, Jeez, I guess we're getting Scrounders. them both then. Damn. What kind of brutes are you trying to attract? They have to be at the nice looking place too, right? By like at the docks and stuff. Where people like probably go into the city and you're just greeted by those two idiots yelling at each other. Alright, um can we buy anything? No. Can we sell anything though, maybe? Um do do do. Let's see. Just going through this really quick. Um uh, I just need one that says selling for metal shards. Oh, there we go. Uh, I think that's about it, really. All right, and then let's go grab this other quest down here. And then we'll make our way My family might towards still that errand. Alive, and you're going to stand here and do nothing? Tell me what happened to your family. Maybe I can help. By the sun, I fear they are all dead by now. I barely escaped alive. Machines. Vicious machines attacked my family's estate. Father sent me to get help. Okay. Uh, what kind of machines? What kind of machines? Long, le <laughs> long leg or whatever? Ravager. Oh, Ravager, great. By the sun, how it cut down those guards. And a pack of watchers came with it. That's fine. Watchers are easy. The Sun King warned us that he could no longer protect freeholds beyond the valley, but... Father never saw this coming. I'll get him down. Don't worry. Tell me more about the estate. My father owns a dozen quarries. And he's put his spoils into the estate. Fine tapestries, custom woodwork, silver fixtures. But what about the people there? Of course. Their lives are all that matter. My father and sister, plus a dozen guards and servants. I hope they survived. Okay. I'll see what I can do about the estate. You will? Oh. Sounds surprised. Thank you. Oh, please. Be careful. Those machines are deadly. Don't worry, dude. You're talking to Aloy. The one and goddamn only. Why do we have to go back to them, dude? Are they going to tell us that they want a certain lens now? Or do I just have it in my inventory already? I definitely have the snap mill ones, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Uh, let's, let's go to this one, I guess. Oh. I have a long leg lens to sell. Huntress, you haven't just brought me metal. You've brought me joy. If I could pay you twice over. Okay. Start buying solid parts instead of baubles and you could afford to. <laughs> Don't think beyond your purse, man. There's use in these if you've eyes to see and a heart to feel. Okay. What about a belly to feed, huh? You've got a surplus you can pay. <laughs> Oh, right, I'm guessing once I get a snap more one, then um, I thought I already had one. Um, clearly, I don't. Um, then we go back to them, maybe. Okay, let's go down here. I'm... Oh, hold up, hold up. There's a box on the floor, and there's probably a secret up here. Let me go see. Uh, no, you can't even get in there. Cool. All right, go to the water mill. We can certainly do that. Keep her going. Keep her going. Alright, it's not too far away. This place does look really, really cool though. Definitely 
like a popular place, you know, could, you know, have so many people here, hundreds and hundreds, if not thousands of people here. Like, it's a nice place too. Like, you have a nice, I like, look at this water, it looks clean, it looks fresh. You have like the wildlife out here. It's just like a, it's like if you're a, like a, later. okay. It's like if you're um, in a survival game for the first time, like um, Ark or something, right? And you just come here and like build your village next to like the water and everything. And you know, you got all the wildlife on the other side. Looks quite cool. Um, okay, go down here then. See what we can do. Oh, actually, hold up. Let me grab all this health stuff that come in handy later. There we go. Grab this, grab this one. Yeah, we're getting loads now. Stocking up. Exactly. That's what I was thinking. Oh, I want this one. Nice. And now we grab this last one. And make our way towards this little quest. Oh, actually, hold up. Oh, we have to go in here. Hi, guys. I guess I will go all the way here. I was told to expect you, Aloy. I suppose you want answers. Well, it's not complicated. Okay. We collect valuable objects from people who don't need them, sell them for shards, and use the money to help the needy at Sunfall. Um, uh, valuable objects. You mean you steal? Yep. If you want to call it that. From hogs who've had their turn at the trough for generations. Ravon didn't seem like a hog to me. He stinks just like the rest of them, of wealth and contentment, while people beneath him suffer. Hmm. Who exactly gets the shards at Sunfall? Not the bastards in the fortress. We use the shards to make sure the poor in Shadowside get to eat or bandage their wounds. They only went west sure because about that? they had to. Trust me, I know. My wife was chained up with a bunch of servants and herded with them. They starved to death, still bound together. I'm... I'm sorry. So am I. Okay, sword? Where's the sword now? Safe. I haven't sold it yet. Um, so what now? What do you expect me to do now? Walk away? I was hoping you'd help us. They say you can track like a stalker. Well, my partner, Nassan, disappeared near the branded shore. He was bound for Sunfall, along with an entire shipment of food. If you found that, you'd be helping a lot of people. Okay. I'll consider it. But only if you return the sword to Ravon. I knew you were going to say that. Fine, I'll return the damn blade. Nassan was supposed to meet his contact at an old campfire on the fork near the branded shore. Start looking there. But be careful. Lots of machines out there. And lots of Shadow Karja. And shadow Karja. not the needy kind, but they're tormentors. Well, I'm down. Let's go. Goddamn. Kill some people. Um, Alright, so... This we need to do this. Um yeah, let's go do that quick. Um should we maybe go for this bonfire here first? Um yeah, I mean it's it's close, right? Depends if it's up there, which it could be. Ah, it shouldn't be though, it should be over here, I think. Um okay, so I'm not sure what we should do right now, because we were on the main story quest last prepared. time. So I kind of just want to continue with the main story, but at the same time, we just got a crap ton of goddamn errands to do. So I kind of just want to bash those out, and then once we've done that, then return to the main story. But it looks like, you know, some of the quests I have, like, oh, never mind, it was side quests I have, I mean. Like, some of these side quests are level 30 anyway, and like 25 and stuff, right? So, well, the one that's here, I think, is level 30 at least, um, if it's here. So... Um, we obviously have to stay here for quite a while, it looks like. So we'll be leveling in this zone and everything. Oh, hold up. Oh my god. That is cool. I love that they did that. Should I just kill this? Yeah, if we kill this. Not the smartest idea, x this. Not the smartest to kill him in water, but, you know. I don't know if he still needs that lens. Oh my god, I knew that was going to happen. Oh no, he had to move his head at the wrong time, right? 
Last one dead. Hey, when in doubt in this game, just goddamn um, roll. You, you can never do enough rolling. Hey, I got achievement for that. Nice. 10 vulnerable machine kills. Oh, that's a really good modification, I think. We're getting loads of good modifications right now. There we go. There we go, even. Um, okay. Nice. I don't know if we got a lens. Oh, no, we did. We got snap more lens. So I don't know if I can return back to them or not. Oh, my God. All right. Um, what's this? Go to the... Wait. Okay. Is this number one? Ah, okay. Let's go to this one. I know it says two. So we're supposed to go to this one next after doing the first one but it's already close to us so we may as well go here i like the look of this place though it's like forest vibes the and then desert and everything okay let's go kill the two oh come on i just did that these are really easy to kill though so i'm actually happy with that come on jump up already or just go FK. Come on, I'm just waiting for you to jump up. I know I should be hitting it on, like, the back and stuff. But it's just a problem trying to hit it, man. Especially because it's in water. Like, I can't hit the underside. Can I, like, strike it? Dude, this is insane. There you go. Where's the other one? Is that it? No, that's just... Oh, there you are. Come on. Come to me. So we can fight. This is kind of like a one-sided fight right now, which I'm not complaining about, but... There we go. Is this supposed to be this easy? I feel like I'm bugging it out, man. You die now. Aloy, you should probably shouldn't, you know, jump in when you kill it because it might electrify the water. Probably not, but... Alright, what do we do now? There's a lady here or something? Wait, was that a kid? I have no idea. Um, Talk to... Yeah, we gotta talk to you. Okay. When we fled oh, from the cages during the liberation, I tore through this clearing, thinking my friend was behind me. I kept running, but here she remains. Thank you for making it safe for me to return. No problem. I don't want to rush you, but it won't stay safe for long. I understand. I've done this before in waking dreams. In the pool, I'll find the bracelet of seeds she dropped when she fell. Okay. The seeds will be split, escaped, grown wild. She's passing from my memory into the jungles. Aww. I'll tell her it was I who died here and became a stranger in her own land. And she who still lives in every time of planting, of rains, harvests. <laughs> Whoa. I like the, like the face paint, man. There. Her bracelet. And I thought she was behind me. But there's only my reflection. Do you need to be alone? For the first time. I am. That's deep. Jeez, man. I like the cracks in the face paint and stuff. It, that's like another added detail to this game. It's actually really cool. Like, I'm really enjoying this. Really, really nice. Um, okay. So, we can try and get up here. There we go. And uh, we need to go. Oh my god, it's all the way up there, man. Let's try and do it. There's a board there. I'm pretty sure we can upgrade stuff like our inventory and everything, potentially. Um, but I'm not 100% sure. So we're just going to go up here and Tomb Raider style it, basically. You know, just climb this up. Must be the sun's climb, hopefully. Where the Banuk wants to paint his mark. Yep. Okay. Go to the top of the. Sun's climb. I can certainly do that. Go to the Shrine of Kings. Alright, let's go up. Go up and see what is up here. 
Oh, what the hell is that? Hmm. That's a flying one, isn't it? That's gonna be fun to kill. Uh, let me just make loads of arrows. Uh, looks like we're gonna fight, boys. Damn. Where's this weak? Like, what's this weakness? Like, where? Under, I think. If that's how hard they are, they are very easy. I just got hit. You know what? Maybe they're not that easy. Um, I'm just going to go all the way up to the top and fight it. Oh, dude. It, did it just die all the way down there? Oh, my God, dude. I wasn't ready for another one. I know I saw it, though, but... I went to loot the other one. Let's go. Haha, <laughs> you just got meleeed and you're a bird, dude. See ya. Level 20 reach, boys. Let's go. Five more levels and we can go to that armory. I mean, we can probably go there early. I just don't... I'm not sure if we can use that gear. That's the only problem. That's why I'm not going there. Nice. Free of the city. Wait, what? Someone's talking? Who the hell's talking? Okay. So there's a metal flower somewhere. I'm guessing it's along this little rope. Oh. Or is it here? Uh... It's got to be across that rope, surely, right? Yep, yeah, it is. Do, do, do. I got to loop that bird down there, though. There we go. Uh, Where did it die, guys? <laughs> it died somewhere down there, I'm pretty sure. All right, let's go down. Um, talk to the pilgrim. Oh, there they are. Cool. Sup? You were a better hunter than I. I'll paint the mark while the spirits of the Glintox linger. There'll be more where they came from. Yes. Yep. There will always be more machines. Their spirits find new bodies, but we only last as long as memory. Damn. That's why I must leave this story. A monument to our vanished shamans, To the wisdom the Karja bled from us. The machine oil in the paint will preserve it. Preserve their memory against all that was cut away. Huh? What? You have my thanks, Hunter. Oh, nice. Damn. Are getting wrong. All right, let me just check for little secrets right now, because there might be, like, I'm thinking like a hidden chest or something. That would be cool if there was one up here, but no, nah, just definitely not. Damn, dude. Okay, so we've done that now. That's actually pretty cool. Um. It was, oh my god, look how much stuff I have. Like the Meta Flower, Meta Flower, Meta Flower, Vantage, Vantage. Oh my god, dude. The map just got very, very busy. Jeez. Okay, well, we can go get that. And then, so, okay. So we are still on this one. I think since we started it, we should 100% complete it. However, there's this. Which we can obviously do. That's that's closer. Much, much closer. So we will go to the Shrine of Kings. After we go down here. Oh, wait. It died here? Cool. There we go. Alright. There must be a quick way of getting down, right? I guess this is kind of the quick way. And we go get that campfire. Nice, dude. That's what I like to see. New machines, and we're just, you know, killing them all. Wait, what's this? Charger. Ah, oh, that's kind of like a ram, dude. And there's... Oh, hold up. There's another one. I don't know what that is. Let me go see quickly. I won't kill it, I don't think. We can definitely go have a look. So there's a boar. Or whatever. Ah, oh, it's a snap more. Who cares about snap mores, man? Um, okay. I wonder if there's going to be, like, tiger-type machines, you know? Or, like, leopards or polar bear ones, you know what I mean? It's like, stuff like that. 
That'd be cool. Or like goddamn dinosaurs, right? Like, jeez. There we go. Save these for the trail. Why is it playing that type of music? Okay. I guess we just go down here. Wait, is that guy fishing? Yo, know, this guy's just straight up fishing. Um, we can't fast travel. Are you kidding me? Uh, okay. Whatever. We just keep moving towards there, I guess. Um, I guess what I'll do is I'll cut to when I get there, really. Um, I know this is a nice place to look at and obviously and everything like that. Like, it looks gorgeous. Oh, there's a box. But if anything interesting happens, I'll obviously just cut to that. Um, but yeah, uh, I shall see you when I get to the person, I guess. Two seconds. Oh, we found another box, guys. Let's go get this real quick. Nice. Another one. Let's go. And then we can use this elevator. Dude, it looks so weird during the night time. Like the glow effects and stuff. Whoa, that's quite cool, actually. We're getting there. Slowly but surely. And um, let's grab some more arrows. There we go. We've got a lot to craft. Um, we have a ton of, like, shards and everything now. Wait, how, how what do I need for this? Wait, what's happening? That's a bit weird. Someone's bugging out there. Do you see that? Uh, I'm literally just crafting everything. There we go. Alright, we're fully stocked up now. So if we get into a big fight, we have everything. Dude, something doesn't sound good. I'm guessing it's the... I'm guessing it's this. This elevator. Alright, nice. So now let's run to... The other place, only 190-ish steps to go or whatever, so we will be there very, very soon. Business, hey! Don't talk to me like that. People are just so rude in this game. Oh, this is a new place, though. The Meridian Gate. Do you have a goddamn box for me? Yep. Oh, out of stock. Have I already spoken to you before? Probably. Um, okay. Let's go down here. Imagine if I killed the wildlife here. <laughs> Be like, sorry, I needed it for upgrades. God, all of the guards and everything would come after me, probably. Alright, we're nearly there. Slowly but surely. 50 meters or footsteps or whatever you want to call it. This must be the Shrine of Kings that Naman told me about. It's a public monument, oh, not what's his that? private shrine. You won't get in there. That dried up old prune in a robe sees to that. <laughs> I can be persuasive. But what does an Osram want with a Karja shrine anyway? It reminds me of someone. Gone two years now. But what does a girl like you know of loss? What do you mean, dude? Try me. Exactly. I had a lover. Worked on monuments to their bastard king. Then he gave them a show in their sun ring for good measure. The Karja gave me back his broken bones, but what use are they? They won't build again. They won't make me smile. This man's depressed, and dude. seeing a statue of the Mad Sun King, Will? I, I need to see his work again. The marks his hands carved. The set of the metals they hammered. That's the soul of him. But that shriveled up old priest won't let me near it. I'll see what I can do. Okay. We got you, dude. Every time I go near the statue, he turn away, child. The abiding Jahaman wishes to be alone in his retreat. If you want to be alone, go someplace else. Others want to pray here. Defile it, you mean? Yet another debasement of what was once pure. Truly, our tribe has lost the light. Our king is false, our temple is corrupt, and our soldiers weak. The sun hastens across the sky for shame. Hmm. Uh... So the Karja have become impure? What does that even mean? Is Meridian not meant for those who built it, who made it great? Not really. It was pure before outlander squatters took it over. 
You mean Meridian was pure when the outsiders were in cages or dying in your arena? Oh. The sun is pure, child. It is not our place to question its divine will, only to act upon it. Um. I thought Avad taking the throne was the sun's will. The boy dishonored his father. Dishonored us all. To kill the sun king. What shadow, what twilight time he brought upon us. And how many more would the mad Sun King have killed if Avad hadn't stopped him? The Sun called for blood. Damn. There was no choice but to obey. That was definitely a choice, man. You called the temple corrupt, but aren't you one of its priests? Oh, <laughs> she went they there. They call themselves Sun Priests, but they have no authority. Youths and oh, that triggered them. all. Yet those who gave their whole lives to the Sun's service are shamed and ignored. So that's what this is. Attention. I was just about to say attention. attention. You know nothing of our rights, and yet you dare to insult me. Why do you think your army is weak? Because you're not at war with everyone? A Karja throne relying on forged dirt mercenaries? Preposterous. The so-called liberation was nothing but a purge. Our most blessed warriors, chased out of the city, exiled to Sunfall and the Forbidden West. Our tribe oh, is the torn. Forbidden West. The ones who walked in light. Oh. Go by shadow. Whoa. Yeah, everyone, but you seems happy they're gone. That's so cool because the next game is called Horizon Zero Dawn, the Forbidden I'm West. Arguing with you. That's cool. Stay or go, but I won't allow you to keep others away. I am here by the will of the sun. Okay. You're a coward. You have no authority. Here. Change has already happened. Um. You have no authority here. You don't believe in the throne, the priesthood, the army, or the city. So, I guess you have no authority here. Uh, I have the authority of the sun. Sure about that? Then call it for help. No one else will listen. There'll be a reckoning. Good. You'll back away from it. Ha. <laughs> yeah. Get wrecked, noob. That's right. The Let's go and follow them, I guess. So that's the statue thing. <laughs> Sorry, uh, we kind of just interrupted you straight away. He gave them the best work he'd ever do. And look at it now. They defaced it because they hated what it stood for. They defaced a thing slaves like him lived and died for. Slaves they've already forgotten. Short-sighted bastards the lot. If they thought their son set off this bridge, they'd jump after it. I thank you for honoring my wish. It's so good. I hope you can find peace. I wouldn't know what to do with it any more than the Karja do. Damn, dude. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, man. What's down here? Oh, death, apparently. Jeez. Um, some could say you flew too close to the sun. <laughs> you get it? Because the sun. Okay. Uh, okay. So, like, a look up point. What is up with this music, man? Oh, Vantage. Let's go up there. Let's go see this Vantage. Real quick. Um, only 165-ish meters away. Or footsteps, or what? I, I never know what to call it, man. I'm guessing it's footsteps, because it has two feet. Like, next to it when you like look at it but at the same time that could mean literally foot like it's measured in feet i don't know um all right how do we get up there that's the real question we obviously have to climb um okay so if we go this direction maybe there's a little climbing spot up here let me see real quick I wonder if there's like a grappling bow you can get Probably not, right? A grapple bow. Oh, what's this? Oh. These are helpful. Bitter though. Okay. Um. Okay, let's go down here. We're level twenty already, though, man. It's actually insane. Hmm. Any time I have to do some more walking, dude. What are you? You're a broadhead. Sorry to spoil your fun. Oh my god, dude. Oh. Hey, I was hitting you first. These are just uh, the um 
Kind of like the Striders, I'm guessing. It's literally Striders for this area, I think. But just reskinned. Um, that's what I'm guessing, at least, right? Because they don't seem to, like, want to fight in a sense. They fight if you get too close and stuff, but that's it, really. Um, okay. How do we get, how do we get to this vantage? There's probably a thing I missed, right? Well, we go for a little adventure. If I can like override those things, it's one hundred percent like a just a strider, really. Okay. Yeah, what's up? Some, what's up? What, what are you guys I have doing? To go back to work soon. <laughs> just go home and sleep. I have no idea how I get up there, guys. Um. Okay. So look, the path is there. Maybe through this, that, maybe? And there's like, yeah, maybe down there? Uh, no, definitely not down there. Unless I just missed, missed the opportunity to climb somewhere. Maybe up here? Definitely not up there, because there's no like climbing thing I can get up, so... I don't think I can climb up there. A few moments later. Oh, hold up, hold up. How? Okay, that's the grapple down, I think. Ah, it's here. Found it. It's because it's not like a big, bright yellow thing, right? That's how you normally get up. Uh, Tomb Raider style. Nice. My girlfriend's been really wanting to play this game, though, so I need to try and complete it as fast as possible so she can play it. She's kind of asleep right now while I'm recording, so hopefully she doesn't spill, spoil this if she watches. She's asleep, so it's all good. Alright. Hey! Now we can scan it. Oh, it's one of these again! A pocket shit storm Love tour. This. Day 9. I was setting up my tent right here when Wyatt's call came through. I came as fast as I could, but you'd already slipped into a coma. Oh. We never got a chance to say goodbye. Oh, that's sad. Oh. Damn, dude. Well, that 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 took a goddamn turn. That was really sad. Um. Okay. So what we can do now? We haven't discovered up here yet. So we're gonna wait. Uh. Oh, we gotta go here. Should we just go? Yeah. Let's go grab this. Because we're probably going to need to go down that direction later anyway. Love it when it does that. So goddamn cool, man. Um, we'll probably have to go down this direction after. So what I'm going to do is just discover this place real quick. And then I'm going to fast travel back. Hand in the quest or whatever. And then we're going to go and do some more quests. This video might be a little bit of a long one. Because I know it's like an hour already. But we've barely done anything. We've picked up quests ran around. Because Meridian is just so goddamn big. That it takes actual minutes to get to certain places, so um, all right, let's go and take this quest. Oh, wonderful! Don't bother me, Outlander. I don't need a mercenary. I need a miracle. Someone who can tell me who slaughtered my men. Okay. I'm a good tracker. Maybe I can help. What happened? Mass murder. That's what. Five night guards shredded like cabbage out there in the quarry. Okay, uh, dead gods. Five men murdered? How? Don't know. One was a buddy from before the liberation. We worked this quarry together as slaves for the Mad King. That's not My good friend, at all. May he walk forever in the light, knew how to fight. Fiends who did this must have had stealth or numbers. Okay, machines? Could machines have killed them? Don't see how. The quarry is fenced and gated, and I've never seen a glint hawk do anything like this. Oh, he's actually seen the glint anything hawks. Anything strike you as strange or out of the ordinary? Well, let's see. Uh, I think oh, I know. Yeah. Chunks of corpses, gushing blood. <sighs> Sorry. Pressure's getting to me. Not used to murder. No, nah, nothing unusual. Well, except we've been doing a little blasting lately, and Saravad said, No, that's just stupid. Um, uh, blasting? You've been using explosives? Sure. To clear away bedrock and get to the good stuff, we do it for a week or so every year. But that's got nothing to do with the dead. They were... 
torn apart, not blown up. What exactly did hmm. Saragod say? Ah, nothing. Kept babbling about a pile of rocks out there. Said he didn't remember it from yesterday. I told him that this here is a quarry where we move rocks all day. So rocks getting moved ain't so surprising, lunkhead. Oh, maybe it's a machine that buries itself underground or something. I'll have a look around the quarry. If you think it'll help. What I was thinking he was talking about. Standard. Oh, what the? Uh, Aloy, can you go down here? I had my hands on the wrong keys. But I was thinking, could it be this thing? This creature killing everybody. That's what I was thinking. Because um, that's a different creature to what we killed earlier on top of that like um, lookout point. Um, should we just do this quest real quick? I think it'd be quick and easy, right? Since we're here and everything, we're just mixing quests and everything today, or, or errands, or side quests, or whatever they are. I'm guessing they're side quests, but um, it's okay. If we go up here, there might be a box or something we can pick up. Haha, <laughs> I know this game too well. There we go. Um, okay. And then we can see. Nope. Yeehaw, cowboy! Ow! x this you're not very smart. You're a lunkhead. <laughs> That's what he called the guy or whatever. Lunkhead. Oh, we got to be careful, I think. What is that? That's explosive. Corey's been doing a lot of blasting. Oh, there's a shovel there. Yeah, we got to be... What just happened? Hold up. I swear the ground just shook. Huh, okay. I don't see anyone here at the moment. We go look at this. It's strange. Where did this mound come from? Oh no, we're gonna have a 1v1. Deadly rocks, dude. A suspicious pile of rocks. Yeah, I told you. Oh my god. It went underground. That was foreshadowing. Oh boy. You're a big one, aren't you? Oh, it's gonna go where I am. Okay, yep. Alright, what are you? Uh, you're hard to hit, that's what you are. Rock breaker. Weakness. I'm just gonna use this. Whatever that does. Oh, that's that's actually insane. Okay, so it likes fire, it seems. This, I'm not gonna be able to do this, guys. All right, round two. Um, I'm gonna heal myself. How do we get him down then? Let's just think. So I got some trip wires going. I'm gonna move because it's gonna come up here. This is gonna be difficult, dude. Yeah, we have to attack the hands and stuff. We do, we just play it safe. It said it likes fire, didn't it? Yeah, strength is fire. Luckily, that did no damage. I right, set up some more chip casters. Fence yourself in. And we wait. Alright, round number two, guys. Oh my. That's no way. I didn't think that hit me, but okay. There's got to be an easier way, guys, to kill this thing, right? There's got to be. How am I supposed to get it out? It, like. Oh, maybe I just got to explode it. Oh, I know what I do. Hold up, can I just loot this? Thank you. What I have to do, I think, is this. If x this is smart... Nope, this I mean. If I'm smart, when it comes close, I have to blow this up. 
Okay, that did nothing. This is kind of annoying, man. Okay, yeah. Um, I don't know how we kill that, guys. Um, that's a suspicious pile of rocks. God damn. Oh we can, we one, can kill you? it. Oh my god, dude. No, dude. Oh my god. One hit and I'm just dead. Like, this is... This sucks. This actually sucks. Just come out of the ground, man. Kind of baiting him to come out there. How? Guys, any thought on how I'm supposed to kill this? Like, I know you can't help me in real time right now. But I guess I just take my time and dodge it. If I have to use all of my shock things, I will use them. Can I shoot him, please? Right, we got loads of armor off, which is, which is kind of my goal, and I'm still going to die to the sheer damage, man. Please? Come on! I need to use my other boat. Maybe this one better. Yeah, good job, Aloy. Not really, dude. If he hits you once, you're dead. Uh, I just tapped out. No! no! Yes, 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 yes. Come on. Come on, X-Rathus. Get him down! Oh, hell yeah. Oh, that's literally the only... That's the, literally the... It's going to explode. Hold up. <laughs> Just hold up. Um, that's the only way I know how to kill machines like that. Is just spam them with these, um, these shock bombs. And just go to town like that. That's literally the only way I know how to kill the, like, um, the enemies like that. Like bosses. Because... I have no idea otherwise because they deal so much damage and I just don't have the meds ever. But man, that's really, really cool. Suspicious pile of rocks and looks like we did it. But at what cost, man? All of our meds apparently. Like, damn, I need some armor that just helps me tank damage because I get hit by one ability and that like a quarter of my meds go. I get hit in by another ability. I nearly die. And I have to waste all of my meds. Like, it's actually insane. So, yeah. That's really unfortunate. But at least we got it down. Oh, my God. I had a feeling it would be one that buried itself, too. And it was. I've never seen a machine like that. Whoa. Nor a hunter so bold. Take yep. this. It's from the quarry stores, but no one's going to argue that you don't deserve it. 
Thank you. May you walk in the light, friend. Especially when dealing with what comes up from the ground. Long time. Oh my god. So we got a remarkable reward box. So what do we actually get? So uh, let's open up this one. Open up this one. Generous reward box. Open up this one. Nice. Again, rock ammo. I just don't have, I have too much of it. Nice. All right. So if we go into crafting real quick, travel. Oh, you can craft them. Yeah. Um. So ammo, obviously, so carry capacity, resource satchel. Can't upgrade that at the moment. We can do that though. Traps and potions. That's just what I can craft. Wait, there's health potions. Oh my god, dude. Oh my god, I keep forgetting that's a thing. I need to use these, man. I need to use those. Look, there's a resistor. Oh my god, I'm so dumb, dude. 100% corruption resistance for 60 seconds. There's freeze potions. Like, against that, I could have... Wait, I, maybe... Like, this health bo boost potion would have came in handy, right? Um... Oh my god, man. Oh my... I'm so dumb, dude. I never use these. Never. Because it's so awkward to, like, navigate, like, those buttons down there and everything to try and swap. Oh, I'm so dumb. That's actually a good job. I just realized that. So I think it's X. So X is to switch between these. So, But I, I can't remember how you use them. So all right, let me just try it out. So Z maybe? No, Z to go back. So maybe it's like oh, nice. F. Glad it's F. Okay. It's weird because you have to go Z to go left, X to go right, and then F to actually use it. Oh my god, man. Hey, at least, at least we know now. I don't know if I clicked on this campfire, but we're doing it now. Nice, dude. At, at least I can do that now so that we don't use all of our materials all the time. Uh, let's go fast travel back to Meridian. We have so many fast travel packs, so we will go and do that real quick. Damn, I've been enjoying this game, though, man. It's, it's difficult, but it's because I don't use what the game gives you, right? I need better gear and well, better weapons and stuff. I need... Like, I have some good weapons at the moment, but I could obviously do with better ones um and armor and stuff like that oh the mad sun king if you want to read this then obviously go ahead and pause the video i'll just scroll through it really quick there you go if it's audio logs and stuff like that i would always listen to them uh but if, with those ones um i just don't want to you know spend ages reading through it because I always spend a lot of time um, going to time places and doing quests and stuff, so. But you can buy, like, lenses and stuff on that person. Cool. Alright, and then let's go talk to this weirdo, man. Oh. Never mind. Okay. So you've come back to the temple. I was invited back. The priests wanted to hear what I had to say about reconciliation with the other tribes. They're listening. At least they've begun to listen. There's a distance between ears and deeds. Because of what we did? What you did. It was for the mourners. I think it helped them. You set them on the path. You can't know what their journeys hold. Such is the priest's lot. Perhaps a red robe would suit you. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> Not me. Besides, your temple doesn't even take women. Damn. We would be richer if we did. Go in light, my friend. And let the sun cast your way. Thank you, Naman. Where I'm going, I could probably use all the light I can get. Yay! Honor the fool and completed. Okay, guys. Um... I really want to do the main quest, so today's video is going to be a long one, um, but hey man, it's all good dude. I want to do the main quest, so we're fast travelling and we're doing the main quest because I am not going another episode where we just don't do another main quest, you know. I mean, don't get me wrong, 
I like doing the side quests. I like doing the errands. I personally don't mind it. But because we were nearly done with this quest last time, we may as well continue it, right? Because I don't want to wait another episode where you'd want to see me go and, you know, do the main story quest and then just make you guys wait and everything, if that makes sense. Like, I just don't want you to wait. I'd rather get it done and everything like that. So we may as well do that right now. And then we'll be done with that quest. And then we can obviously go do a new quest um, at some other point and, you know, do the all the side quests in the next episode or something like that. So I think that just makes sense. All right. Now I know that we can use potions and stuff. So I don't need to use my meds all the time then. I would just use them These will keep. if I don't need the sudden healing, if that makes sense. If I get hit in combat, I just use a potion. Makes sense now. Um, I wonder what that armor's going to be like, though. I wonder if I can get that before level 25 or not. Because um, I wanted to go back there and check. But right now, we're obviously in this zone and everything. We're at Meridian. Um, so we'll just stay here for now. But I really wanted to go to that armory and get that armor. But I won't. I don't know if it just say you have to be level 25 to use it. And then that'll probably just waste a load of time, right? So I'd rather just go back there when we're actually level 25, just in case there's a level requirement, because... Yeah, but that armor should hopefully help. Um, I'm not sure if we're going to be able to get, like, machine guns and stuff at some point, because there's, like, skill points and everything. Ah, oh, it's a Ravenger, guys. It's a Ravenger. Alright, we got to go up there anyway, so if we have to fight it, we have to fight it, but I'm going to try and let them pass. Okay. Leroy! He doesn't see me just yet. None of them do. Oh, this one does. In a second. Oh. Oh my god, dude. I can't tell these are evil. These are... Oh, they're definitely evil. Oh my god, you have like a stun thing. Bit late on the music. There we go. Hey, it's nice and sunny now. Um, we go down here. Oh my god, this place, man. Reminds me of like Star Wars or something, like Dune. I never watched that film, but I get like vibes of that. Grab all this. Kill myself now. And then... Oh, hold up. Let's grab this one. I saw a machine behind here too, so we just got to be careful. What even is that machine? Corrupted one, right? Oh, they are with the machines. Ah. Oh, what the hell? There's just people chilling there? Alright. Okay. I know there's another healing thing behind me, but... It is what it is. Oh, I'm in their little base camp. And I'm stealing their loot. I literally told someone not to steal earlier. But all good. It's like, oh, don't steal that sword. And here we are. Oh, it's one of those things. Oh, it's Olin. This is my oh. Ten. Wait. To bring these ancient things back to life. Their power serves us. Wasn't he Machine in the proving? Beneath the ground. I don't know. It's a nightmare. Nightmares. Yes, the worst dreams of our enemies come true. Yes. Rise. Oh God. Olin, you gotta help us, dude. We'll take care of them. The music just helps out so much. So much for catching him alone. These things will destroy us all. They will only destroy our enemies and bring us back the lands that were taken. Ah! Oh no. Stop. Ah. Stop working. Search the area. We may have intruders. Forgive this intrusion, Eloy. You left me no choice. Who are you? Oh. Who is this? 
an interested party. They got me on speed dial. Now the focuses are disabled, but I don't know for how long. The rest is up to you. Who is this? Master Luke. <laughs> wow, dude. All right, let's go, guys. Who's calling me, man? Used to call me on my focus late night when I need your love. All right. What do we need to do? Kill the Croptors and the Cultists. Oh, they actually... Oh, I can do that then. Watch this, guys. You ready? Speed. God, I'm speedy. One dead. Uh, can I headshot that guy? I might be able to headshot this guy. Boop. Yep. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Uh, I don't need to... Oh, I don't. No turning back. Lives. Kill her! No! You had your chance. Uh, what? I'm so confused. Oh, they're helping us. Oh, legend. He controlled them for us. That is sick, man. They're helping us. Wait, so was that Olin helping us? I'm so confused. Oh, wait, now they're not helping us. Wait, what's happening? Oh, wait. Olin's down. I don't know what's going on, guys. No, I'm trying to craft, right? Well, not craft. I'm trying to make stuff. If I remember correctly, is fire good against these things? Alright, let me just check your weaknesses. Weakness? Okay, yep. Can you go away? <laughs> He's just burning. No! There you go, use a health potion now. Oh, you wanna fight, dude? Oh, he took the grenade! That was like the quickest health potion I've done. These things are normally easy to kill. I don't understand why they're so hard now. Oh, you know what? There we go, there we go, there we go. Big hits, big hits. Oh, you know what? You need to die. Oh, is that Blaze down there I can use? I don't think. Oh, I think I need to just shock them. This is getting out of hand now and they're quite annoying. Oh my god, I just missed him. Okay, he just charged in for me. Where's the other one? The other one's over here. Let's go take this one out first then. It looks like he has blades on his back. There we go. Oh, Olin's actually helping us. Okay. He is there. Oh, what? What's happened? Guys, what the hell is going on? I just got one shot. You see what I mean when I say I really need new gear or something? <laughs> Alright guys, I'm going to take a different approach to this. What I'm going to do is I'm going to see if I can get to Olin and see if he can help us real quick. Alright. Got to be careful. That's what I want to do right now. See if I can get to Olin and then maybe instead of him, him being downed, 
He will actually help us. The Nora girl lives. Kill her! No, you had your chance. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Die, dude! Oh my god, I can't aim. I can't aim. I can't aim. Alright, let me just hold up. Let me use a potion. HP potion. We need to kill this now because uh, this would be like my third attempt or whatever. Oh, he's hiding like a little wuss. Alright. So, we can do like a blast thing. I mean, this fire one will come in handy, I think. Oh, that's actually a bit of damage. Oh, that's a bit of damage! Okay. Need another potion then. Does Olin actually do damage or is he just there for fun? Alright, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna set more traps. Oh my Do not come this way, please. I don't even know you could come this way, dude. I mean, that's actually kind of works out for me. Come on, then. Really? If you're going to fight me, just fight me already. At least we're behind cover now, so it makes it a little bit easier. But it also... Well, I have to do... So I do 11 damage to them. Come on. Body is weakness. Oh my god, we dodged that like a pro, man. Oh, it's got the temperature gauge thing. So I think it means once it hits full temperature, it explodes or something. This is going to take me a while, guys, but we'll get there in the end. There we go. It's heating up. It's heating up. I don't know if that's what it actually means. If I have to waste 100 goddamn arrows on it, I will. Wait, can I not just... Yo, Olin, you're gonna help. Uh, okay. Oh my god, Olin. You're literally gonna kill me. Jesus, he got my way and I nearly died because of that. Longest fight you're ever going to see, guys. I've still got another one to kill up there. I liked my spot earlier. I feel very out in the open here. Why? Because I literally am. Nice. There must be an easy way to kill these things, right? Oh, so he's, he can't do anything right now, I guess. Because he's heating up. So he can't shoot or anything, I guess. Maybe that's what it is. They're smart, though. They don't run in my thing. In 
my traps. Ha, <laughs> well, I say that, I didn't write it that one. How many ammo arrows? Four left, three, two. Guys, I'm just gonna use another potion. I just get a strange feeling I'm gonna die, man. Yeah, go in that, go in that, go in that. Come to me. He's jumping it. Oh, come on, dude. There you go. Guys, one remains. Wait, did they run off? Do I have to actually chase them now because they ran off? Oh my god, dude. I actually do. Wait, guys, they ran off. Surely that's it now, right? Was my game bugged? There's no way. Uh, Yo, guys, I actually think this is bugged. Um, let me jump up here and see. Yeah, but it tells me to stay here. Wait, it's actually bugged. Oh my god, there's no way. I saw it got up here. Dude. It actually bugged out. Where's the other watcher? He was up there. Oh. Maybe it hasn't. Maybe it's just one guy left. Never mind. I'm being dumb. I swear I saw a watch up there, but it wouldn't make sense. Oh, oh now you want to play like promise. you need help. I'll tell you everything. I know you will. Uh, the killers. The killers who came for me at the proving. Who are they? The Eclipse. Some kind of holy warriors. A cult of the Shadow Karja. Shadow Karja. Except they're not like any Karja I've known. They don't pray to the sun. They worship some kind of devil. Damn. I'm not interested in their superstitions. Oh, it's not a superstition. Their devil is real. It has a name, a voice, the most terrible voice, and they do its bidding. Damn. The devil? You say this devil, the Eclipse Worship, has a name? Hades. Oh, call it. Hades. Oh. Hades. And you've heard it speak? Steal to my soul. Isn't that I the god of just once death or something, you, right? Such a voice, a cold, awful jangle. It scrapes your bones, it hollows your guts. A metal sound, but like nothing dug from the earth or smelted in a forge. Oh my god. And what did it say? System threat detected. Just three words, but in the voice of a devil. The eclipse. What are these eclipse cultists after besides me? They never said. But given the Karja civil war, they must want to overthrow Sun King of Ard and take Meridian back. What do I have to do with that? I don't know. When they attacked the Proving, a man came for me. Tall, strong, dead eyes. He is. And who is he? The Terror of the Sun. Stacker of corpses, we Asuram called him when he was the Mad Sun King's champion. Oh. If only he'd died with his king. But now he leads the Eclipse. I tell you, he's the most dangerous man alive. How did the Eclipse recruit you? I know they took your family hostage, but why you? I was a scrounger, a rummager in dark places, good at what I do. I suppose they knew I would serve them well as a scout. I had taken a delve near Maker's End. When I surfaced, they were waiting. I laughed when I saw the priest. But then he showed me Helis's encouragement. I didn't laugh after that. They gave me a focus to watch my every move. I followed orders. Ah. Uh, you had access to Meridian. That's why it's why so didn't shady they get at to the start, then. You? Too much to my, my nails for an audience with the one true Sun King. But whatever Ursa or Aaron told me, the Eclipse heard every word through my focus. That's why I couldn't warn you. If I tried, they would have killed my family. Uh, why ancient Why are machines? the Eclipse digging up ancient machines? And how do they get them to work? 
I thought they wanted them for scrap, but they brought them back to life. Plugged some kind of device into the corpses so that Hades could whisper to them and call them from their grave. I've fought that kind of machine before. Are there others? Yes. The ones you fought today, they call corruptors, but there are others, much bigger, bristling with ancient weapons. Oh my god, weapons? Those they call Deathbringers. Oh my god. I've only seen them buried in the ground, but after today, anything is possible. Sounds to me like they're raising an army. If so, the world will fall. And I helped dig the pit. Oh god, dude. The Eclipse were sent to kill me because I look like another woman. Older, maybe twice my age, short hair. Who is she? I don't know. My focus found her image once, in the ruins at Maker's End. Maybe you can find her there. You found her image in the ruins? How? There was a door beside it, a kind of ancient device that contained the woman's image. My focus recorded the location. You do look like her. Is she your mother? I'm the one asking questions. Whoa. Time to judge I've you. I've heard enough. It's time to finish this. I won't beg for my life. But Ain't they watching me right now? You, free my family. Please. Where would I find them? My focus recorded the location. There are always guards there. You look like you can handle yourself. Really? <laughs> this is complicated. Your life is for redeem yourself, I'm just going to say, because I'm a good person. Look at her face, dude. She's angry. This is complicated, I could say. Your life is forfeit. I don't think so. He's he's trying to do what's best, and his best just benefits himself and his family rather than thinking about others. But at the same time, I get where he's coming from, right? He's trying to protect his family. Um, just he's he's kind of flawed because he doesn't know what to do. Like, he's, he doesn't know what to do, so. It will take... Yeah. Many good deeds to make up for the crimes you've committed. You're sparing me? After all I've done? Give it a focus. Forge a new life, Olin. One of better make. Then the rest of my life will be lived in your dead. Go to the place where your family is being held and wait for me. We'll make their lives the first ones you save. I didn't earn this mercy, but I will die to make myself worthy of it. I will be waiting for you. Okay. We said, we, all right. Look, the, the way I see it, guys, right? He has made some mistakes. He tried to kill us, basically. He sent people after us, but he was being controlled, basically. There was people who basically, I don't know how many times I can say basically, Jesus, man. He was being put in a situation that he couldn't control. Um, he had to do it or his family died. I get where he's coming from, but at the same time, you know, we were in the forefront of that. Nothing we could have done. Nothing he could have done. Well, I mean, he could have not sent those people or whatever to kill me or help them in any way, but then his family would have been killed. So I do understand, but at the same time, I chose to spare him because obviously he can help us later on. Maybe he will help us. And there's no point killing him, killing him right when he was only trying to help his family. I know he did try to kill us and everything, but whatever man um yeah let's go to the save point then save our game and then that will conclude today's video but man those machines are tough like it's so hard i don't understand how people can just breeze through this game like uh can i get up there or is there like a path i guess we'll just go down here i just don't understand how people can breeze through this game like it's so difficult and i'm playing on like the easiest difficulty maybe i'm just not good at games like this which definitely could be the case um i don't claim to be good at these types of games or i don't really play single player games much oh my god it's been like an hour and 44 minutes that's insane man um so this will probably be the longest horizon zero dawn video i've done and i said that in like the last one or something so that's ridiculous but hey ho i'm loving this game and i'd rather keep playing it if i'm enjoying it right I know I said these episodes would only be like an hour to like an hour and a half long max or something, but whatever, man. In a new zone, we got to Meridian, we confronted Olin. Like, the things are looking good right now. The action's there, man. And we failed a couple times on the machine thing, but it's all good. Alright, let's go down here. Go to the campfire. And then in the next episode, we will continue with, let me see. So we got the main story there, level 14, which is good. We have two main story quests, which is nice. Next episode, I think we'll do the side quests. 
like a couple of them and hopefully the main quest something like that oh what's that oh it's a big boy it's a big boy indeed all right let's save and then we will go from there. But guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. This one was a blast, man. It was difficult getting those machines down, but we actually managed to do so. I thought it bugged out, but it turns out it's just a guy chilling up there. I um, hope you enjoyed today's episode, though. Let me know in the comment section down below whether you think saving Olin was a good idea he should really take his focus off because they can just look through his focus and see what we're up to like they probably know of us now well they know of us anyway but now if we get close to olin they just know that we're with olin and stuff and they know that he's with his family so he kind of needs to take that off before they slaughter his family and stuff so hopefully they don't do that but i just thought he can help us later down the road yes he's done loads of bad things but he can redeem himself and maybe he will you know risk his life to save other people later on and well hopefully he won't die but you know what i mean maybe he'll just do stuff for the greater good um but yeah if you enjoyed today's video make sure you leave a like comment down below and subscribe to the channel I'm trying to reach 5k subs so if you could subscribe to the channel that'll help me out a ton and more videos to come and everything like that don't forget to check out my social media links in the description down below and make sure you have yourself a really nice day i've been x ray this and i catch you in the next episode, you know? So, have fun. And yeah, i catch you in the next one. So, peace!